Hey, hey, Sonoran Sounder here for PPP. Once again, we've got three projects and an additional landscape. All right, we are off and running. It looks like I am player two this time to start. So what do we got? We got some interesting projects. Cathedral sewers. So obviously you're just picking one of those. Presumably cathedral. Citadel is always good. Um, so I think I'm going cathedral citadel as my preferred projects. Presumably opening cathedral. Um... Get in the voice chat here, I guess, in case there's anyone that wants to... I need to unmute myself, though. Okay. In case we've got specs that want to listen live. All right, so, I mean, the only plus buy is Wine Merchant. You got gains from Livery, gains from Horde. Oh, Animal Fair will probably eventually be plus buy. I mean, Magpie is going to be great. Um... Coven looks terrible. They're not opening Cathedral. That's interesting. Is that the only trashing? I mean, you could set aside with Island. That's not good. I mean, I think this has to be... Oh, we do have the um, Baker token as well. I suppose that's important. I think I'm opening Cathedral. I mean... It's like always the right choice, isn't it? <laughs> Sometimes it's not, but I don't see any reason why I wouldn't go with Cathedral here. Um, I could open Magpie and then get Cathedral. That way I don't have to spend a coffer, but I think I just want Cathedral. To start, get started on the trashing. And then I think it's magpie. I want to get the magpies reproducing as soon as possible. All right, so is this livery minion? Probably not a wine merchant yet. I think I want a livery. Not sure if that's right, actually. Oh good, I got attacked. I guess I don't get a trash a estate, but all right, so now do we want minion? Highways don't make sense until we start getting plus buy with wine merchant, right? Well, and are we really getting wine merchant though with no village? Probably not. Maybe co I mean if they're not gonna trash, maybe Coven is good here. No. Um, I'm not really sure what direction I'm taking this. I'm going to take the baker. Right, I don't think... Well, I gotta buy something here, so I guess it's silver, right? I guess I don't have to buy something, but... Okay, don't like getting my livery discarded. So they're just going for the big old minion stack. Um, I think I just draw through here. Is it too early for a horde? I don't know that it is. I think a horde is okay. Give me some golds, which I may end up eventually trashing. I mean, I could even conceivably green here with four aqueduct points if I get my horde. I mean, I think I do, right? I, th 
think so. Whoops, trash first. I mean, I guess the minion attack's a little rough on a cathedral. You've got four cards. I think I'm just going to keep provincing. Well, probably I won't keep provincing, but in theory, I'm going to keep provincing. Yeah, I don't, I'm not sure what their, what their plan was here. I mean, obviously their plan is to do the minion stack, but, um, Duchy, province, I think I'll just take another province. Yeah, they realized it. was just way too slow. Um, so that was their start. Um, so that was my start. Oh, and then we got to do the kingdom card thing. Um, what was the... Oh, shoot. What did we have? Did we have an event? event. Oh, it was a landmark. Oh. That was a landmark. That's right. Because that's what I got all the points from the aqueduct, right? Okay. Well, that was a nice start. Like I said, I think what they were doing was just not the way to go. All right, so game two, 5-2, uh, doesn't look great here. Um, we got Piazza, we've got Academy, we've got Canal. Um, all three of those could be good here. Um, we could invest. So what are we doing here? I mean, certainly, with Exorcist being the only only trash and we want one of those, do we open that? Mm. I mean, Academy as a village could let us skip Festival, but Festival is the only plus buy. This is a tough open and then do I just pass on two? I don't I guess if I open Exorcist I just get the moat. If I open Academy I get the moat. I think it has to be Exorcist. Could be invest sheepdog. Is a sheepdog stack here good? How how is sheepdog getting activated when you gain a card? So in the night phase with Exorcist, with Bandit. Mm, I'm just gonna open Exorcist. I wanna get rid of these estates in particular. Yeah, I mean, Sheepdog, hmm. I'd certainly rather have a sheepdog than a moat. I'm gonna take the moat. Oh my goodness. I don't want another moat, do I? Boy, these are sad draws. At least I didn't bottom deck the moat, so I will have six here. Oh no, five in the exorcist. Um, yuck. Maybe this is invest sheepdog. So what did they open? They opened Oasis Exorcist, that seems fine. They got another Oasis. Um, 
I don't know that Oasis is all that good here. I think Silver's better. Hmm. I don't know what I'm getting here. Am I investing in festival? Doesn't seem great, but I just, I'm not sure what else I'm doing here. I think I take the sheepdog now, right? Certainly trigger the shuffle. Hope they don't find the sheepdog. So they get the bandit now. Oh, or the wisp. <laughs> um, so I got my exorcist down there again with no estates. Wow, this is not going well. Guess I play this sheepdog. Okay. So what am I doing with four? Investing in festival again? I guess with no silver in my deck, I'm not likely to... Um... Oh, maybe I should not have blocked there. Um... What's down there? Sheepdog. I think I'm gonna let him attack me this time. Oh, great, two sheepdogs. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay, I feel behind. I've not had great draws. I don't know if this festival stuff is just horrible. Um, oh, good, festival. Um, Probably time for me to get a bandit. Uh, probably time for me to get a bandit and an imp, maybe. What's down there? There's two festivals down there. Do I draw? Do I draw? Do I draw? Two festivals, three coppers, I think. I'm gonna draw. Okay, well that worked out well. Um, I think I'm gonna exo this sheepdog into an imp. Do I want another moat? Or do I just want canal first? Maybe I want canal before I start getting golds into my deck. I'm gonna take canal. I don't know if that's right. I'm not sure if anything I'm doing this game is right. So I guess I'm skipping Academy now that I got three festivals in my deck. Yeah, they're provincing already. That doesn't surprise me. Oh, wow. All three of my festivals. That is not good. I mean, I guess I knew two of them were down there. Well... Bandit Festival Moat? Um, 
this I block. Do they really, have they picked up any draw or are they just kind of doing a strictly money thing? Um, so again, I know there's no village down there. There's a wisp, I guess. And I don't want to trigger the shuffle, right? And a sheepdog. Maybe I should have just left that there. I guess I block. I don't know. Am I just too far behind? All right, is this Piazza time? Piazza, Scepter, Sheepdog. Do I really want Scepter? Or do I just want like three Sheepdogs maybe? I don't think I want three Sheepdogs. Bandit's the only thing that triggers it. I guess Academy, there could be something to be said about just getting Academy as well. Yeah. Do I want a Scepter or would I rather have another Festival? Maybe just another Festival is fine. Right, I can get a, um, I don't have to go Provinces, I can go Vineyards. In fact, that's probably what I do now. Where's that bandit? There it is. Okay. Um, all right, my deck's starting to come together. How many action cards do I have? This is easy to count, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 so far. Um, surely I go for vineyards. So is this... Do I want a province or do I just not even touch provinces? Do I go double potion here? Potion, potion, festival, and two sheep dogs. Eight, six, fourteen. I could do that. Maybe it's just one sheep dog. Oasis could help me find stuff. Oh, and I, I didn't even think about the fact that um, Canal's really helping these Wisps as well. That's an important distinction with all these normally three cost cards. Um, is it just another Sheepdog? Yeah, I think it's another Sheepdog. Yeah, perhaps I should be getting... Oh, nice. Okay. Imp. Festival. Imp. A wisp. Hmm. 
Well, that's sad. I didn't get any uh, bandit activations. Uh, let's see how much these vineyards are worth. They're already worth as much as a province. So I guess what I'm doing is working just fine. Um, festival, festival, sheepdog, sheepdog. Uh, I guess I could take a province too. Well, province probably is not great for my deck, but... That's a nice hit. Um, guess I go moat next. Do I want to play all that? Maybe I should not play a copper. I should probably not play a copper, right? I suppose I could exo the gold into a ghost. What am I buying here? Vineyard. Um, I can't pile out, can I? Vineyard, festival, sheepdog, sheepdog would cost, that's only eight. I guess I take the ghost. I don't know. There's probably not enough time left in this game for the ghost to really be relevant, is there? Ooh, I don't like discarding the imp. Mm, surely bandit now. Um, I should look at piles. No, I can't do anything about piles, can I? Uh, I know I'm getting a vineyard. Guess I'm just buying a bunch of action cards, right? I'm trying to make my vineyards worth more. Navigator, is that actually good here? <laughs> Probably not. Um, There's just three oases. Sure, I'll take another province. Ooh, this is sad. Well, that ended up coming together. It was a little nervous after some of those early draws, but... Um, I guess it's just like three oases. <laughs> yep. Yeah, those vineyards were really good. Okay, and that was my first player, but it didn't feel like it at the beginning, so... All right, so now I gotta remember what we had here. We had, <laughs> um, shoot, what do we have? What was the, we had an event. <laughs> yeah, I used invest. 
All right. My memory isn't so good today. Oh, this is Tokyo. <laughs> That's right. He was saying... He was having problems with this... Uh... Mm. Okay, that's weird. Yeah, I've played him before, and apparently with his Wi-Fi... Apparently with his Wi-Fi, the Tokyo server, we're back on Oregon server, um, like crashes his internet or crashes his browser or something. So, yeah, I've had that happen last time I played him. All right, interesting. Anyway, we're back in business. Got the first two under our belt, which is nice. Um, so we've got pageant, plot, and innovation. Um, again, all three of these look very relevant. I mean, with Artificer, innovation can be very good. Uh, I suppose with Cobbler as well, right? The first time you gain an action cards in each of your turns, you might play it. So, sure seems like we're going to want innovation, which means we would choose between plot and pageant. They open fool. I guess I'm inclined to do the same since they did. Um, I mean, I don't really like giving uncontested. Access to the fool boons. Uh, I mean, I guess I don't have to open it. Other option would be black market. What am I getting on four? Militia, plot, pageant, necromancer, trashing. I guess, I mean, there's black market and necromancer, but certainly sentry is what we want to get here and presumably on our first five. So am I, I'm not excited about opening fool. Really unexcited about opening fool. Maybe I artifice for it later? I mean, what else would I get though? Pageant, not great. Black market. I want black market at some point too, but they go militia. Um, yeah, we're certainly going to need black market for villages, aren't we? Mm, I guess with way of the frog, collision isn't horrible. All right, I suppose I got to get the militia attack. Okay, no collision. They do have collision. But we've only got two coins unless we find Forest's Gift. I suppose we could draw a card as well. Oh gosh. Oh, we draw the Militia Dead. Um, I guess we take a gold here. I mean, we're not buying anything with two, right? Boy, that... <laughs> Drawing that Militia dead is terrible. Mm, do I want more silver? No. Not if I'm gaining a gold. Black 
Boy, that was an awful turn. And now I can't even get Sentry. Doubly awful. I guess I get Plot here. Do I want a boon? What's my best case scenario? Swamp Sky Sea. Field Wind Forest. I think it's Don't Discard. I think I'm going Plot over Pageant. Again, we miss five. Um, presumably, they're going to play Fool next turn, but I think we just discard all of that. Boy, I almost clicked on Pageant, but I want Innovation, right? I guess I go Necro here. Maybe I go Black Market and try to get a village soon. Let's do that. Let's go Black Market. I think this isn't a... Well, this isn't the best trigger, is it? Mm, I could top deck the Wisp by a Sentry. Because otherwise, then my Sentry misses the Shuffle. Frog is so much less exciting than turtle. Or I could draw. No, I'm going to add token. Add token. I'm going to turtle and I'm going to get a sentry. That's nice. Uh, I think I draw here, right? <sighs> Do I discard this? Maybe I just trash the stupid thing now. Do I care that they have unrestricted? I can get a Necromancer, right? I mean, if I, why am I buying innovation if I do? Is it doing anything for me yet? Maybe it should be a cobbler. And then innovation? Cobbler's not great. All right, I'm getting innovation. I could buy something from the black market here and innovate it. All right, so they got outpost, innovated outpost, which is nice as well. This one may be, may be too far behind in this one. Now that's a nice way to trash the fool. Oh wow, they get to innovate again because this is a new turn on the outpost. That's nice. Gold, huh? I don't know about gold. I mean, I want to trash. Do I take the Masquerade? I don't know. I really need a village. Uh, 
Um, I think I just have to trash with Century. Um, is this another Century then? Probably. Innovate a Century here. Could be Innovate an Outpost, but I think I need to do more trashing. Could frog it, but I think I'm better off just playing it. Oh, I drew my other sentry dead. Are you kidding me? Wow, this is rough. This is rough. I am in rough shape. I think it's all about the black market now. There's a potential way back. Get goons or king's court or something. Of course, I'm never going to be able to afford either of those. That century was awful. Yeah, none of those seem exciting. Man, I can't even get like a necromancer here. Didn't want to draw one, but kind of felt like I needed to here. I mean, it's way too early for outpost for me, but really want to trigger this shuffle. play it as I'm gonna play it as a fool. Gain a wisp. Not sure what my way back here is. I think, like I said, it's playing the black market and getting some good pulls. As much as I hate not playing the militia attack. I mean, I thought I was going to be getting Artificers here, but... Oh man, I want that plaza. I want that plaza. Oh, I've got Lost in the Woods as well. I think I'm playing the Black Market. Yeah, at least they get through some junk. Okay. Want the border village. Um, innovation is action cards, right? Cobbler is not an action card. Um, do I innovate it? I guess I'm in my... Can I get a... Um, I could get the Arathesor here. Is there anything I'm excited about innovating here? Not really, unless it's like a Necromancer. Can't get bizarre, huh? Click, 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 doesn't work. Um, cobbler or Arathesor? Cobbler, not really exciting. Get, I mean, Necromancer, I guess. What's in the trash now? All right, I'll take that. I can frog it, which is nice. Uh, 
by just taking two cards here again. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, he's greening, so distant lands is a good way to green. Is that their fourth century? That's a lot of centuries. Do I pop the plot? I think no. Okay, that's nice. Um, maybe I just discard one. Am I going to be able to play all this, though? No. Certainly I play the outpost. Does that mean I'm discarding the black market, then? I think so. as I need to play it with something that gives me more action. So I could play it as a Mason. That's only one action. And I'm just playing it as a spy. I just trash a silver now. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm just playing this as a spy. Okay, militia. Outpost. What am I buying with six? Any idea what I'm buying with six? Um, am I buying gold? I don't think so. Am I buying an artificer? I don't think so. I don't think I want more cobblers. Maybe it is just another century. Maybe it's gold. I don't know at this point. I guess I just take a gold. All right, so surely I pop the plot here. That's a horrible one. Uh, I guess I'm gaining a Necromancer to my hand. But what am I playing it as? I guess we can figure that out. Oh yeah, I can figure that out now. Um, just play it as a Militia attack, I guess. Which means this is what? Just a spy? Am I provincing? doesn't seem great to me here. I feel like I'm really underplaying this. Can 
can I build more here? I don't know why this is such an awkward build. I guess because there's no villages in the kingdom. Right? Other than like necromancer stuff or something through the black market. And there's really no draw of any sort. Um... Hmm. Militia attack hurts, doesn't it? Mm. I mean, all of those have a place if you have enough village support for them. Hmm. Am I just trashing silver now? Ooh, Hagler, Villa. Or am I just provincing? I can't really... Hagler... I don't think Hagler works here. Villa's nice as another village and as a buy. I think I'm just passing. Boy, I just feel like I'm playing this board horribly. I don't know if their early province just has me scared and now I'm buying provinces early. I mean, as much as I talked about wanting a village, a villa is a village. As not great as it was there. Just have very little deck control. Feel like they have better deck control than I do. Yeah, I'd love to get to the point where I'm Having a full turn, playing outpost, popping the plot on the outpost turn, having another full turn, and kind of rinse and repeating all that. Those are good boons. They seem good to me. Okay. Century. Guess with that on top, I'm doing Zombie Spy. Could Mason it, but I think I'm spying. And then the next one is maybe Black Market or Militia. Um, so what am I doing with this? Militia, Black Market. Didn't find my outpost, that's sad. I think I'm gonna do Black Market here. Okay. Um, Boy, I'm tempted to take that bishop. Is that bad? I think it is bad with my limited terminal space. I would love to have some alt VP sources, but... Oh, actually I can bishop the lucky coin, right? Innovate the bishop. Trash the lucky coin. All right, we'll do that. Don't know if that's right, but we did it.
Nice to have some Alt-VP. Um, again, though, with my limited terminal space, not real exciting. I guess I can zombie apprentice it at some point if need be. Oh, they're gaining a sea egg. Wow. Discards a necromancer. That's not fun. Yeah, I mean, I guess you can play the Sea Hag. Again, it's Alt VP. <laughs> Maybe not Alt, but it's a way to score at this point in the game because that curse is going to be hard for me to get rid of. I'm not going to be able to play the militia, right? What am I doing here? I'm playing the outpost. And just not buying anything? And then popping the plot on the outpost turn, I guess? Yeah, let's do that. Can put the militia on top. Oh, I forgot I had a cobbler coming in. Oh, shoot. I completely forgot about the cobbler. Um, I guess I apprentice the militia then. Love to mason that curse. that's the right way to do it, but get to get rid of our curse. All right, what are we buying for three? Black market, innovate it. That doesn't do anything. Buy the fool and innovate it. Let's do that. Oh, I already innovated? What did I innovate? Oh, I innovated the Necromancer. Um, I guess that's fine, whatever. I'm not trashing that. Um, Not discarding that. Maybe I'm just leaving all that on top. Yeah, I mean, I got a decent top deck for next turn. Black market certainly didn't pan out, did it? Maybe there's a shot that... I mean, they can certainly province here. Obviously, there's a risk that I also province, though... Without being able to pop the plot doesn't seem all that likely. 
I, mean, I guess I already have five coins in hand. Hmm, I thought I was pretty dead here, but they could province outpost. That would be, I mean, if they can buy a province here without having to use coffers, I think that's worth the risk for sure. They're certainly having a turn. Yeah, although I guess if they're short on their outpost turn, well, I don't think you can, wow, they're using three coffers to province. Interesting, okay. Well, if I get lucky, if I draw my gold, I think I lead with the wisp. That way, if there is a gold, I can draw it with my border village. Although, yeah, that would be good, right? Okay. So if I stop here, I've got six. Does that mean I have eight? No. Why did, why did I think I had six before? Oh, I drew a necromancer, top deck the fool. Um, I should be able to get there, right? I don't have enough actions to play Necro as Militia and then play Black Market Bishop, but I can play Necro as... Apprentice? And then do I apprentice the Bishop or do I apprentice the Fool? Right, because if I don't, right now I'd only have seven if I play the Militia. This has got to be Apprentice. I think it's the Fool. Oof. Mm. I am short. Copper in two provinces was not the draw I wanted to see. Um, maybe I can innovate something with black market? No, that's not going to work. Wow, now I wish I'd have done the bishop. Didn't find outpost, just found a bunch of junk. Oh, wow. Um, was innovating an altar, trash bishop gain duchy, that's not doing me much, I can't buy the king's court, I guess I can innovate Sylvia and hope to trash something good of theirs, is that good, or do I just need to get a duchy here? Yeah, I think I'm lost now. Man, that was an awful draw off The Apprentice. I was pretty sure I was going to get there. I guess I could have top deck this bishop too. I still can if I buy Dame Sylvia. But that doesn't seem good. I um, guess I go Dame Sylvia and hope to trash something of theirs that's good that they want. That's probably not the right play.
All right, I assume I just lose now. Um, I guess this is an estate just in case I need the point. Do have outpost, so if I get a turn, I'll have two cracks at the province. But seems unlikely. Man, that was close. Really close. I guess I was hoping to trash their outpost. That would have been the best case scenario. Well, they've only got four cards in hand. They've got one coffer. The fact that they're pausing gives me some hope. I assume they have an outpost in hand. Um, Okay, one of their go two gold. No, I got two golds. That's their only gold. So you could either go duchy here, or yeah, do something like, okay, that makes some sense. Um, so now I need to think about the strategy for my turn. Do I pop the plot, hoping to hit eight? on this turn, or do I pop the plot on the outpost turn? Which would give me one more card, but of course, it's an outpost turn. Um, what would I play this Necromancer as? Probably as a Militia. I kind of feel like I'm trying to set up my outpost turn, which would mean play Century, get junk off the top of my deck. Let's do that. So they've got a three card outpost turn with, oh, they had a cobbler too. Oh, so they might get there with two, two coffers and either a necromancer or a militia coming in from the cobbler. Yeah, I've got my cobbler down there too, which is a bit sad. I get it innovated as well. They're gonna draw. Guessing they're there. They only need four coins in hand. They got four cards. Yeah. All right. Good game. I came up one coin short. All right. My start for the last one. Hopefully they have time to play this last one. Okay, we might have to continue it looks like. All right, so 
All right. Anyway, thanks for watching up to one. Uh, I get to start the last one, and that will be my final game of the group stage. Uh, probably a must win to give me a shot at making the playoffs. I think I'm sitting at nine and six right now, so that would put me at ten and six. Um, anyway, thanks.